Today, Tim and I talk to you about kindness. We talk to you about loyalty. We talk to you about respect. Now, I want you to think. This is this is four. I want you to think of it like this. It's four different people. And this red food coloring is kindness and loyalty, especially kindness that we can show to others. What's a bigger kindness that someone can show? Maybe I know, Bonita. If, you're, if their mom says clean their room and they do it without without fussing, without questioning, that's a big kindness. That's a big kindness. Me, you know that that's a lot of love being poured into somebody. And then there's smaller kindnesses. Maybe somebody just is hurting and just needs a hug. You just give them a hug, and that's a smaller kindness, but still important. And then, you know, maybe you give them another. And then, maybe there's a small kindness. Maybe you just need to give somebody a smile. How many of you know, sometimes somebody just looks down and they just need somebody to smile at them. They see somebody to smile at them. And that's, that's a little bit of a kindness there. But Ruth went above and beyond. Because remember, kids, this was not her family to save. So she could have gone back to Daddy's house, but she didn't. She stayed with Naomi. Then she didn't have to work in the fields. It wasn't her obligation. It wasn't her job. But she did it anyway. Then, did she have to marry Boaz? She did not have to marry Boaz. That was not her responsibility to save the family. Yeah. And then... You know, then she had, then, did she have to bring Naomi into her home after she got married? Right? And you're saying no. You think no? She didn't have to, did she? She could have left Naomi just to be somebody else's problem. But she did. And then she let Naomi help raise her child. Ruth, yeah. Ruth showed the most kindness of anybody. 